barback and barefoot trail training with the baby boy. <laughs> Hi guys and thanks for joining to my new video. This is what we did during the last day, some walking equitation training and this is the second time I canter Yuki at the field. So sometimes it's looking a little bit I weird as he still needs some time to sort out his legs and find his balance, especially on the right side. So, yeah, this is how it is, and we're working on the right side canter. So now we start with the working equitation obstacles. The first one here I'll do is the backwards gate. Yuki already knows how he should do it and what he has to do what he has to do. So it's quite easy. We're just um, training on the details as the basic is already done. Here especially where he should stand because he sometimes he pushes his croup on the gate and I can't close it. Next thing is the bell alley. This time we only did a straight one as Yuki is competing in the next in about three weeks and there is only the straight bell alley in the beginner class for him. So we don't have to train the L bell alley. But this is something he definitely already knows. And he loves rings the bell by himself. But unfortunately, that's not allowed, and at the competition, I have to ring the bell. But yeah, okay. That's just something I trained him, so he always wanted to ring the bell by himself. Next thing we're doing is um, our, the two metric tons, one world right hand side. Then change um, the side, one volt left hand side, and the left volt is quite bigger than the right one, as this is Yuki's um, not better, the worse hand. It's just um, the right side is better, just say it like this. Next thing, the slalom. Same goes for the slalom. Here, if we want to uh, bend his neck to the left, he always resists a little bit as he is not comfortable with finding his balance quite fast. Sorry, that's what I want to say. Yeah. Transition from trot to canter and tender canter to trot already really worked very well. The next thing is the L side pass, and this is definitely something I only trade one time. This is the second time he's doing it, and he's definitely damn fantastic in learning things. Absolutely amazing! It's the second time, sorry, second time he's doing this, and he's already absolutely absolutely familiar with this. So again, find the canter right hand side. This is his not his better side. So this is what we're training currently. Cantering right hand side. No, now I'll stop. As I have a special comment for stopping. Doesn't matter in which, how fast he is, what he's doing. If I use that sign he has to stop no matter what and this is something I just ask him sometimes if he still remembers it as it's just my safety car if anything happens and as I'm riding 
sometimes without a bridle and without a saddle I definitely have a sign to stop immediately so now we train the garacha it's the first time training the garacha and he tries to catch the garacha with his mouth as I trained is it with a croup with a, with a stick that he can that he can catch the stick unfortunately he is not allowed to catch the garocha take the garocha back in the barrel or in the in the top and now i just bring the ring back as my mommy wants to do the same things when she is finished filming me yeah just take the ring back this ring is made of out of soft plastic and it's about eight centimeters is the hole in the middle. It's a little bit smaller than a normal ring. A normal ring has something around twelve centimeters. And now we are doing the last thing, the gate forward. Yuki also knows to do the forward gate, but he is he loves to do it backwards. Yeah, we just train the backwards gate a little bit more as a forward. So yeah, he knows what he's do, and that's it. We have finished our working equitation training.